Hey, what's going on, everyone? Don here, and you're watching VR Gamer Dude. And today, I just thought I'd give everybody a quick tour of the UI in the Vitra One neckband. So I, I just found that I could sideload certain apps to the neckband, I guess basically as long as they are Android TV compatible. And with that, we got our good friend AZ Screen Recorder back, and it actually works fantastic for streaming or recording what I am seeing in the glasses here so that you guys can see it. So, you know, the neckband hasn't fully released. I believe it is coming out uh, on the 18th. But I, I, for anybody who's waiting and hasn't gotten theirs or hasn't seen this yet, I thought, what the heck, I'll give you guys a quick little tour here inside the UI. So UI is laid out really nicely, uh, you know, very, very clean. You got all your recommended stuff down here. We've got the ability to pin some of our favorite apps. Uh, we've also got the apps section. This is going to be for everything that I've downloaded through the, uh, you know, the basic Google Play Store for Android TV here or something like Aptoid TV or, you know, as I mentioned with the AZ screen recorder, as long as they are some, from what I've understood right now, Android TV compatible, you can side load APKs just by hooking the neckband up to your PC and using a USB-C cable. So uh, last but not least, we've got our store over here, um, and that's going to be a lot of the curated apps that Viter has already, you know, said that you should use, like Steam Link, PS Play, Netflix, I mean, you know, the more popular stuff. Now, last but not least, we also have the, the full interface here, and I'm going to go through everything in here, but obviously, if you want to pair Bluetooth stuff, uh, you can turn on the head gaze navigation, or one thing that I found that was really helpful, if you have a old PS3 controller laying around, uh, you can actually uh, use the little mouse pad here. Uh, and not only that, you can even do two finger two finger scrolling. I, so that's fantastic as a means of uh, you know interfacing with the UI here. Um, so you know, I'm not going to go like I said into a lot of this. I, I am still working on a full review of the glasses, which I'm hoping to have up. You know, sometimes next week. Uh, I got a little delayed with my PC going and exploding on me, but the new PC is built and uh, definitely ready to get back to recording some content for you guys. So I, I hope you guys enjoyed this really quick, short but sweet little you know look at the UI here in the glasses and. Uh, I'll see you soon.